Mr. Drift? Hmm. You alright? No. I'm losing in a fight with a bear. I'm meeting some people on your street this afternoon. From the Liberal Democrats. Lib Dems. I was wondering if I could ask you one or two questions. Try to discipline him. Try to open a fridge. He knows I'm talking about him. Should I come back another time? Do that in front of strangers. I haven't really been myself since Watford moved in. The bear. It's fucking mistake of my life. I'll come back another time. Don't bother. Vote for you anyway. Oh! I love Ashdown. Oh, yeah. There's one who's not been a cheeky girl. The most famous one is Lempotopic. Lucky sod. <laughs> Back up a minute. Oh, yes. Toodaloo. You kept going. Would you like some desserts, uh, gentlemen? Oh, God. Yes, sir. Uh, do you have any minority moose? Um, I'd like to look at the board so you can see some of our desserts. I can also recommend the roasted sauce. The bad sugars are very popular. Um, would you like a moment? No, I'll have the trimmings. Very good, sir. Yes. With a nice dollop. Excellent choice. <laughs> uh, yes, please, yes, I'll have the same. And can I have the chocolate cutlery? Of course you can, sir. And can I have that in private, please? Come this way. And can we have one more kilogram, please? Certainly, sir. You are hungry. Yes, thank you. I won't have any of the kilogram. No? No. Let's just have half. Hello there. I'm Clunes. Do you want to come and play down the park? I'm getting a game going, trying to. I've said to everyone, just meet down at the park at five. Just playing rounders, etc. There's swings too. Who are you? Clunes. You've just had a bath, so you're wearing a towel. All right, all right, all right. Um, Which bit of the park? The bit by the tennis courts. But I don't mind waiting for you or something. Then we can go down together so I have someone to chat with on the way. Is this some kind of candid camera thing? No, 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 I am Clunes. Who is it? Martin Clunes. Who else is going down? Ah, uh, a woman from three houses away we've got and some kids are there already. Is Mike coming down, do you know? He's a fairly big chap, lives in number nine. Don't think so. He said he couldn't come down and he pushed me a bit so he could close his door. I was with Neil Morrissey on the Behaving Badly show and I've done some stuff on ITV as well. I've got a funny face. Come on, it'll be fun. Are you like your character in the Behaving Badly show? Clunes? Not really. I'm not as bad as him, not really. So you won't tease me if I don't get around her? Can you put us down as a maybe? Yes. Right, we'll come down on our own steam if we come. Right you are. Thank you, Clunes. Yeah, put the car on the ferry. Yeah. Gonna go over there with Libby. She's got her heart set on going to one of those uh, hypermarches. Oh, careful, they're enormous. <laughs> well, I'd be all right. Yeah. Then back in the car, mm -hmm. and then if we've got time, mm -hmm. we're gonna go over to Dijon. That's the territory. Have a snoop around the universities in the morning, and then uh, possibly taste some mustard. Bliss. Mm -hmm. Right, I'm gonna go. I'm getting nothing out of this. Sorry? It's just insulting my intelligence, this stuff about Calais. I'm going to talk to him. Lou Hutch? You don't even know Lou Hutch? Yeah, well, I'll get to know him. That's kind of the point of the party. Well, well uh, we're trying to have a perfectly nice conversation about Calais there, but... It's a pretty ordinary fare, if we're honest. Is it? Well, what would you rather, that I pitch him with some stuff about how they call the English Channel the sleeve? No, of course not. No. Yeah, I would. Yeah, so would I. Yeah, that would have been fine. Or just sort of quietly, just sort mm. of slope away. But yeah. to, to flag it up, to... to yeah. uh, Flag it up and to sort of say that in some way we don't measure up to your magnificent standards. Mm. Mm. He's saying all the things that I think. Yeah, I don't know. 
don't know either. Alright, if you're finished, I'm yeah, going to talk to you. Yeah, quite finished. Yes, I have finished. Yeah, I'm not even sure what's good about Calais at all, Matt. There we are. Did exactly the same thing, um, Chris White's barbecue. Where's like Starsky? Because of uh, Starsky and Hutch. Yes. Yeah. Chris White's as well. Yeah, I get that a lot. Mm. Have you seen the most Same. recent film I've touched on? Ah, yes. Owen Wilson. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. With Do it. <laughs> yeah. Yes, that's it. Do it. Yeah. Yeah. She came into my dad's infirmary with problem with, with her eyes. So who do you know at the party? Um, do you oh, know, 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 know Ginger Allison? No, but that's 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 well, Ginger Allison used to go out at the moment and they broke up. And uh, ago, I yeah. stayed friends and with Jim Johnson, some scaffolders got really close. Up, After a um, while and much up, agonising, we decided of, to give it a go. We started going out. Uh, scaffold. Fast forward 18 months, one of them must have been me and Ginger Allison are now engaged. Uh, so so, anyway. God, so I yeah, now exactly. live here yeah, yeah. Anyway, he in the bottle with Ginger Allison. And, uh, oh, like 18 cigarettes. You know, we'd look if I were on place, but it's really, really difficult. 40 feet. It's expensive, especially around here. Unfortunately, Sarah really like the area. They don't sound like a do like this area, so I don't know stay around here, but... It's difficult. The cigarette packet had hit her eye. No, that's a bit long winded, isn't it? Out. And she's actually like oh, holding her arm. That's not funny. Fuck you. Not going to be a joke. She then goes off to an infirmary. I'm going to go and talk to Craig Jarrett. For three days, they sewed them up. On the fourth day, she opens her eyes yeah. and she can see through walls. What? She can see through walls. Who's this? The piss off, Otto. She can see through walls. Yeah, if she squints, yes. <laughs> <clears throat> Close the door because the heating's gone. I've, um. But you might want to put a hat on. <sighs> CJ, can I have a cuddle? Well, um. Oh. Why do you want to cuddle? Bloody earth, I'm only going to be like this. Well, I'm not being like anything, Ducky. I... Harry, Andrew. Screw you, CJ. Ducky, please. Yeah, yeah, I'll talk about caught in the crossfire. What's going on? Andrew, let me put it this way. Can I please have a hug? I've just found out my boss is dead. Of CJ course. wouldn't give me a hug. What, CJ? Now, hang on a second. He asked for a cuddle. So? Well, no, a, a hug and a cuddle are two very different things. His boss has died, CJ. Was it Mr. Strong? Yeah. What? Your boss is called Mr. Strong. And? Nothing. I thought you hated your boss. You do not speak ill of the dead boss! Oh! 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 Is that a bag of beers I see? It certainly is, my dear, dear friends, because tonight we are going to quaff a few ales and watch three hours of craft! Yes! Confiscate them off a of juror. Well, that's a pathetic thing to say. It's a pathetic thing to garnish with. Excuse me, kindly explain how using chives... Coffee chives. ...makes me gay when I've slept with three girls this year and only one man. Oi! Keep the chives chat down, lads. I'm trying to watch this Dalmatian being scrutinised. Yeah, well... Just let me know when the schnauzers are on. Ah, now there is a category. You know it. Mm-mm. Friendly, very happy dog. This, yes, this looks a particularly good one. She's a relatively young bitch, but she's also already had some. I'm sorry, I'm such a rubbish crafts partner because of the dead boss. Do you want to phone one of your sex lines? Yeah, I do. Thanks. Jamie, Jamie, how's that? Oh, 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 oh